Mr. Johnny Nelson, doesn't get much bigger than this, does it? Two days away. I think how these guys are, you know when you get fighters that say I'm going to talk the talk and walk the walk, this is one of those fights. I don't doubt for one second that uh, uh, Charles or, or Anthony won't try and back up the boss. I think this is probably going to be one of the best heavyweight fights we've seen in the last 15 years because you've got two unbeaten young fighters uh, that it's not about the dough. The dough is like an extra, an extra. Uh, even the belt is about an extra. You take the belt out of it, take the dough out of it, you put these two in together. This is going to be a hell of a fight because, you know, you excuse the expression, you get Charles Martin trying to pee on his tree, pee on his territory to say, you know, this is me, step up. Uh, and Anthony stepped up to say, all right, let's do it. Now all of a sudden the respect's there because how it is, you'd look, if you didn't know who the champion was, you'd struggle to figure out who the champion is. And Charles is talking, and Charles is there, and he's, he's, how he carries himself, he's confident and everything, but I'm telling you now, you know, this is going to be one of those fights where you are impressed on a massive level. Now you obviously probably got closer to the two boxers than anyone else has with the gloves are off, and they both seemed incredibly calm and confident. But you could see a lot of respect from both boxers. But what did you take from that, having walked away from that, from their personalities? We, we learned a lot from, from Martin's sort of background, which gave a little bit more of an insight to, to you know, his read. journey. I can usually read how fight is going to unfold from something like that. But I struggled. I struggled. I thought, I thought both fighters came out well. Uh, Charles Martin tried, to, as I said, to step up, to make... To make to, Joshua stepped back and he didn't. Uh, uh, Joshua was... He was... He was he was respectful because Martin's a champion, but he said, I, I, I'm not submissive, man. You know, you're going to get it. You're going to get exactly what I'm telling you you're going to get. And he's going to go out there and do his job. He doesn't want to shout too loud because he's thinking I'm Martin in that position to do that because I'm fighting for the world title. But I'm telling you, when the bell goes, you will, you will struggle to see who the champion is. I don't think nerves are anything to do with it. It won't. I think the most nervous people in the, the O2 Saturday night will be the fans. Us. The tournament. <laughs> yeah, and we'll be on the edge of our seats. Those two are cool cats, and they will get out there and get their job done. The third this fight goes to more of a theatre, of a drama this is going to be. Um, I don't think Martin can afford to give Joshua a giveaway shot because Joshua is when he punches it, it's lights out it hurts you're gone if you see usually when Martin's opponents go down they're down they're frustrated and they're drunk they're drunk thinking god where did that come from because he's a reacher he's not a banger where's Anthony he's a banger you see people when they get put down they're holding their head thinking who got the truck in the ring but it's the first southpaw that he's fought do you think that's going to cause any slight problems from he said he obviously has been stepping up with the southpaw opponents and sparring it's about preparation I know I think the last amateur in the amateurs, the last Southpaw he boxed, he lost to. Uh, and Southpaws can be a problem for a lot of fighters. Uh, so it's down to styles, it's down to tactics, it's down to preparation. And I think fitness wise, and Anthony said, is all there. I think preparation wise. It's not going 12 rounds though, is it? It is it going 12 rounds. Not in a minute. You say fitness. <laughs> if it goes 12 rounds. I'm telling you now, it's going to be the best heavyweight fight we've seen in our life if it goes 12 rounds because these two are fit. I saw uh, Martin train that in Big Bear. He's fit. The kid is super fit. He's got an American football uh, strength and conditioning with him somewhere. Yeah, and, we uh, saw him earlier. And this guy's on it. They ain't messing about. And then I saw Anthony train. I thought, God, my, you've got two, two units there, two machines, and these. You know, guys. you know, I'm going to do this to you. I need to put you on the spot. It's I want a prediction from you. <laughs> you know, I love both. I, no, I love Anthony because Anthony's that boy, and uh, and and I like. Ta him. Take away any sentimental, emotional hat. I'm struggling. Uh, no, I would go Joshua, uh, and the reason why is because I think the second Joshua hits him, he stays hit. Um, I think if, if even if Martin hits Anthony and he and he goes down, I think Anthony can get through that. We've seen him do it. We've seen him when he boxed from the amateurs. We've seen him when he boxed Dylan White in his last fight. We've seen he recovers well. But I think the power of Anthony Joshua when he hits Charles Martin. It's going to be a game changer, and that's when Charles Martin is going to try and box, do what he's best at. Uh, uh, but the thing is, will pride and character come out then, and will he think, no, you ain't doing this for me, and stand there to have a toe-to-toe? -to -toe. That he doesn't want to do, because a bigger puncher is Joshua. But I think technically, when it comes to boxing skills and tricks, it's Charles Martin. So, so who's going to talk who into who's kind of fight? Is Charles Martin going to say, I'm king of the hill? I'm going to stand out there and tell you what, I'm going to do something that, you know, I can box, but I want to fight. I think as soon as he gets hurt, it's going to become a, a boxing match, more of a chess match. Well, it's uh, definitely a 50-50 fight. We can't wait. Yep. Two days away. Thank you so much for talking to Box to Box and uh, enjoy ringside. Thank you.